And let's see. Fuck it, we'll use this color. Se hizo ese en un video. ¿Por qué? No, thank you. Entonces ya voy a congelar las, las de esas porque ya, ya están haciéndose tristes. Ok. Hello everyone. Hopefully our life is better. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome everyone. Bienvenidos al club. Al club. Oh my gosh, I just found some two beautiful colors that I did not, I did not remember I had. Alright guys, hello, hello. I just found two more colors. Hello. Hi guys. Welcome. Where the fuck did I use stupid color? So check out the glitters I just found. I think they will go pretty good with holographic. Beautiful. All right, so I'm gonna start off with a nail. I have no idea what the hell I'm gonna do, but I'm just gonna take these colors out already before this stupid shit starts to lag again. Oh my god, it's lagging on my end. Hello. Yes, I'm gonna use glitter. I'm just gonna open these all and then we'll see what I end up doing because I feel like when I have too many ideas, you know, it starts to get ugly. Um, so we're gonna do like a pink and purple set. Let's see what colors I use from this. I think I'm going to use those two better. The darker purple and the darker pink. Okay, where's my trash can? I need to throw on my chiquito. Alright, so I'm going to start off with an encapsulated flower. Only because I haven't done that in quite a while. Hi, Stacy. Hi, Portia. Let's see. I think I'm going to do the middle finger as the flower. Hold on. Let me move you guys a little bit better. I'm going to do my flower on the middle finger. But I'm just going to give it like a little base of this luscious pink. Just like a light layer, just to give it some color. I'm sorry if it is laggy. I don't know what the hell is going on. But let's pray that it's it starts to behave. Hey, girl. So right here, I am using um, Luscious Pink, just very, very lightly. Like super, super thin. Let me zoom in. And I'm going to be using my lavender acrylic along with the glow in the dark. What fucking color is this? Glow in the dark number eight to do my flowers. 
And then I'll probably include the luscious or whatever. Hi, buddies. How are you? Hi, friend. Hello. Hello, everybody. How are you? So I'm just going to make some flowers first. And then we're going to go with the flow. You can never go wrong with flowers. Portia needs to do some lives. I know, Portia. I think we need to schedule a live where we get to watch you work, girlfriend. You have a lot of love up in here. We just got to get you to start it first. So everything that I am using is available on my website. I am um, using my Kalinsky number no. six brush just in case somebody is is gonna ask and i'm using lavender along with the pink glow um pink glow number eight i don't do poly gel i was actually really excited for mccart to send me some product but they ended up sending me gel extensions and i'm like what i thought i was gonna get poly gel so now i cannot do no poly gel oh you got frustrated with the flowers girl it takes a lot of practice i think i'm gonna add a little bit of white so they can pop a little bit Where are you? White acrylic. Oh my god, I was looking for you, Crystal. You bitch. You bitch. You were hiding on my desk. Alright, hold on. Let me get my white acrylic. I kind of messed up by adding the base, the luscious pink kind of camouflages a little with the purple. Well, at least in my lighting, so I'm just going to go ahead and add a little bit of white. Yes, Portia, we need a light from you, girl. All right, so I went ahead and changed the lavender for white. Only because I'm not sure my eyes are failing me or what the fuck, but the lavender is a little too light camouflages with the base color do you sell starter kit yes you can check my website and check the kit section we have um three different kind of kits so again this flower is going to be encapsulated i guess i could do multicolor. i'm funny why what did i say girl Oh, this is too big. So how are you guys doing today? I was not going to go live today until tomorrow because I did not know what the hell I was going to do. Are you guys using the internet? Maybe. Hmm? Hold on. Is it a secret? No. Type it. What is my mom trying to feed you? It's freaking hot, man. Don't turn it off. I know. Don't don't use the internet though, because then you're gonna make my my thing lag, or then maybe we need a faster internet. I I'm getting rosa vibes. I wait, rosa peluda. The fucking pillows are falling off. Honey, why you don't like? Can you grab that hair off from the flower? Thank you. Rosa. What do you have me as over here? Go ahead. Okay. Hmm. 
What's the weather like where you guys are at right now? Let's see what state is the hottest. Hello, Beth, Beth, Betty, Betty Lenny. Betty Lenny, ¿cómo estás? So it's so hot today that I do not need any acetone for my 3D flowers, girlfriends. Because está más caliente. Mm, it's the same. You sure? Yeah. Let's try it. I know. I had to try it multiple times. It's the same capital thing. Or no I think the first letter is capital. 70 degrees, 97 in Utah. Alexa, what's the weather like right now? The current weather is 84 degrees Fahrenheit with cloudy skies. <sighs> Bitch, it feels like more like 100. Clouds in the sky with a low of 64 degrees. It feels like 100. Fuck that. So I ended up incorporating um purple, lavender, the pink, and the white in my flower. Mm, honey, you're about to look cute. It's fucking hot. I fucking hate the heat. Do I sell these flowers? No, you have to make them yourself. So right here, you'll see how I make them. You just, they look kind of easy. They kind of are easy, but you just have to practice. Practice makes better. Can I see your nails from the sides, the apex? Oh shit, I zoomed in. You can't fucking tell with my with my bling bling, so I'll show you this one. I was doing a um, craft. I was doing a craft, so I have the little stickers. Hey Zile, hey girl, hi Lori, how are you? Mm-hmm. Practice makes progress. So I'm just going to do partial flowers and then I'm going to add some glitter. I don't think I've done any encapsulated flowers with you guys yet. So why not? How long did it take you to get the apex down? I'm struggling with lifting. Um, To be honest, nobody really talked about apex when I was a beginner so i didn't know i didn't know how thick a nail was supposed to be until maybe like two years ago like i'll make the hump all the way to the top nobody ever said shit about no apex or maybe i didn't fucking know about it no i'm just kidding not two years like four years ago Cause I remember this dude used to fucking bully me. No, I'm just kidding. He didn't bully me, but he used to like talk shit when I would like break a nail. He'll be like, he'll be like, um, para cuando el orange? Was I supposed to do orange nails? Les había prometido las naranjas. Y por qué no me me dijeron? Perdóname, Maya. Yeah, I I keep forgetting that COVID was like almost three years already. Like I forgot. Like that time just did not exist. So it was more like four years, four or five. This guy on the internet would be like, if you had a good apex, your nails would not break. Because there was a time where the me and the refrigerator got in a fight and my nail cracked on the middle that shit fucking hurt like it just cracked but it got my my nail and everything my nat my natural nail and i posted it online and then he was like talking shit and i'm like homie get the fuck out of here with you and your apex yeah with the freaking handle i was like you fucking refrigerator i ain't trying to fight today yeah and then yesterday i was at stater bros at the store and the fucking little cart decided to fight me 
Like I was just trying to reach for some soup and my finger got stuck. It's like the cart held me back or something. Like don't get those. Don't get the fucking soup, bitch. They have a lot of sodium. But I still went and reached for it in my nail bent. And oh my God, it hurt like a motherfucker. When did you start doing flowers and how long? I've been doing 3D flowers since I started to do nails. They were fugly, let me tell you. They've been fugly until maybe like a year into me doing them. Nails are going to break doesn't always have to do with the structure. Uh-huh. Especially because it didn't break off, you know? My nail didn't really break off. It just cracked at my fucking natural nail. That shit hurt. And I was like, fuck you, you fucking nail. You should have just fell off. I would have rather it broken because that shit hurt. And it was like holding on for dear life. So I just added a little bit of pink in here just to give it some color. Some como la flor. But yeah. Raise your hand if you guys, you should have fought back. Uh-uh, girl. I was in pain. Shit, if you guys have never got hurt, never got hurt by, um with your nails i want to compare it to i mean if you guys are a guy and you guys never got hurt like with acrylic nails it's like if somebody were to kick you in the balls type of thing i think that's how much it hurts but it hurt like a motherfucker i was like Diosito, por favor, you know I mean? and i was like i'm gonna do my nails already because it's already been two weeks yesterday was two weeks that I've had these on. Wait, these? And I'm like, girl, I already need some new ones. Nah, nails hurt. Yeah, it does hurt, actually. Let's see. Let me add a little bit of glitter to the nail. And then we'll see if I need more flowers. Alright, so I'm going to add a, a little bit of glitter, you know, like unicorn vibes. Very, very beautiful. I've been wanting to do a um, what is it called? Um, Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty design, but what? I ran out of paper. But I think I'm going to wait until I do my nails again. Can you put some sparkle on your flowers? Yes, you can. I'll add some iridescent one. So I'm going to add... Hmm. I'm also going to use this one, the crystal. This is the one that I use on my nails. I, it's iridescent with a little bit of silver. Just so that there's like some more sparkle when the nail moves. Like a little peekaboo. Can you put this one on the nail? Yes. Yes, I can, but it's gonna be really expensive. Super expensive for you. Hey. Hmm? I was gonna say you're you're not even on the camera, but you are. Yeah, it's just that way. Like there's never enough glitter. Ooh, honey, it's a beautiful. And then if the glitter is too chunky and we're, we want to get some more on the petals, I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit more. This is fine glitter. It's called Fairy. Yes, I'm going to encapsulate them. I'm just starting off with um, the middle finger and I'm going to 
add some more flitter because you can never get wrong with flitter. This one is a iridescent fine glitter. This one you could get it on the petals if you want to. And you won't cover the color at all. So normally this is how I do encapsulated nails, like flowers. I do the flower first, then I add some glitter, and then I fill in the other spots with glitter or with a, whatever the hell. What size brush are you using that people want to know? Oh, for the flower, I was using a size 6. I had to upgrade my my brush right now because it's hot AF. But for the most part, I use a number four. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of flitter for you, Marta. And then if you if I covered any of the glitter, I'm just gonna go back and and put some more. You can never go wrong with layering glitter. Layer the glitter. So I'm so sad. I was trying to upload my my youtube video for the yellow nails and it doesn't want to fucking download <laughs> it's lovely to see that as much as many years you still got in the nail game is really nice to see you still do nails girl i'm about to quit and just kidding now i still like doing nails uh-huh i can't quit it's a girl principe este está muy caro I like doing nails on my fake hand, not on real people no more. They are too stiff. So check it out. Wow. So beautiful, honey. Wow, that is so beautiful. It sounds like a printer. Oh, yeah. Um, am I going to do unicorn nails again? Oh, my God, girl. I should. I've been wanting to do a set inspired by, um, well, obviously, Unicorn. I'm going to do a Frenchie, and I'll encapsulate a flower there, too. Oh, they're, they just look so beautiful. What are you printing? Yeah, I oh, I'm like, you're printing a book or something? No, you're good now. Okay, thank you. Bye. This hand is from Glamour Liz. Dot com. I believe it is the the Liz. Girl, I'm using a lot of powders. So, hold on. The fine glitter. The fine glitter that I was using right now. This one is called Fairy. They're all from my store. This bright pink is called Glow Number 8. The white one is number one. The chunky iridescent is called Crystal. And then this one is called Royalty. I'm thinking I'm going to add. I, I don't remember if I added these to the scoops. The Royalty is so beautiful. I don't think this one is on the website yet. Because it does not have a name. Um, but maybe you guys can help me choose a name. And then the light purple is called Lavender. What should we name it? This, this glitter. What do you think? It's like pinkish purple. It's holographic. What, what should we name it? All right. Let's see. I'm going to do maybe the index finger. Babe. Bad bish. Purple rain. Girl, I already have a purple rain. Dragon tails. <laughs> that is so too. That's so too. That's so true. I used to love um dragon tails. Should I do a French with a no, no French today. No, no French. Dream. I'm gonna have to ask you guys again later because I'm gonna forget. So I'm going to do like a little diagonal vibes over here. Maybe I should do like a wannabe marble. Like just wannabe. I don't know why, but I've been into marble a lot. That is not what I'm supposed to put. Oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's right. I knew that. 
lilac dream mm, you guys are good at these names i could never think of shit so i'm gonna post it on instagram so you guys can comment your name because a bitch is gonna forget and then whosoever name i choose i'll give it to you for free when i i release it i have a lot of colors that i need to bring out purple clouds mm -hmm. purple nurple all right, so this time I'm not gonna put no base because I don't want my my flower to camouflage. I'm gonna do a flower in this one too. I'm so happy I'm not blocked anymore. Sorry, girl, that you were blocked. But my moderators, they be keeping check. If you guys say anything, anything that sounds wrong, you will get blocked. Chiquis trickies. <laughs> oh, that's funny. El, ¿Cómo se llama el acrílic? Se llama chiquis trickies. What color? Maybe, maybe a pink one could be chiquis trickies. So this flower is going to be multi petaled color. Prince. Prince Royce. My eyes hurt. So this is going to be flower power. All the time when I come live, I forget to get my glasses. It never fails. Wow. Has anybody's Instagram been acting like stupid as shit lately? Or is it still me? Because I have, I don't know how many strikes. Kisses by an angel. Ooh. Let me drink some coffee. I feel like um, Instagram prioritizes reels. Instagram prioritizes reels. Why are they giving you strikes? Because I got reported a few times early this year. I gave up on Instagram, girl. I'm about to give up on Instagram too. And I'm just going to be on Instagram. On TikTok full time. But it kind of hurts to give it up. Because I've been on there forever. And I, I'm like, it took me forever. It took me forever to grow my page. For it to fucking do stupid. A lot of people say that. But my posts get more love than reels. I guess everybody is different. For me, the reels go a little farther than my posts. My posts don't really go anywhere. Just within my own friends. Like, ever since... ah, uh, thank you, Yvette. Ever since I got reported the last time in March, like, my page did not go the same. Instagram is tricky, but it's been finally acting right for me. I know. I feel like I have to work extra hard to get my posts to move anywhere into people's feeds. Pero pues. I can't blame Instagram. I've been lazy too. <laughs> Girl, you haven't been live. Why? Girl, yes, I have. I was just live over there. And here. I just choose TikTok over Instagram now because Instagram be doing me dirty. Ooh, Yvette. I never seen those before. Thank you. You do have to post a lot. I haven't posted in a minute. I've been so busy. Girl, I know. I be so busy. I don't got time to be posting. And then if I do post, I post at the wrong time. And it's like... What the hell? 
Ooh, thank you. Those flowers are gorgeous. When's my next YouTube video? Um, I'm trying my best to download the yellow nails that I have on right now so that I could post it onto YouTube, but I've been having trouble. Like, it does not want to download to my phone. Like, the, the video does not transfer to my phone. So it's taking a little longer. Alrighty. Ooh. My shit fell. I feel like I'm adding a little bit of gold into this set because it has a lot of pink. I should probably add a little bit of the iridescent flitter. I sent you a chicken leg. <laughs> Thank you, Nancy. Girl, are you Nancy? Oh, yeah. You're my moderator, huh? I can't recognize you no more without your picture. I shall get used to it. When you guys change your picture, it's like, I don't know who's who now. It's like, y'all, who's this? Hoodish. Sorry, girl, no discount codes. Yes, ma'am, that's why I'm afraid to change it. Well, we just gotta get used to it. Alright, so there's my flower. Right, I almost didn't recognize her at first. Portia was ready to block. And just kidding. Like, who is? Who's this? Nancy. Do we get hacked? All right, hold on, guys. I am going to get a little bit of foil because I feel like this needs a little pop of, of some color. Oh, you fucking bitch. Stay there. Me too. I'm like, I know. Oh, shit. Yes, I'm moving on la verga. Wow, I thought the hand was real. She is. Her name is Tuxica. Tuxica. Her name is La Tuxica. So I'm going to add a little bit of foil. Ooh, Yvette, girl. You popping today with them. With them, um. What is it called? With them little stickers. I'm going to add a little bit more flitter up here because it's looking a little lonely. Gold always makes things nicer. Did anybody go watch the Minion movie? I, I went yesterday and I fell asleep. Like, who does that? That's the hand that got on a fight. Hell yeah. Everyone's naming their hands Toxicas. Why are they copying us? Do you have that brush on your website? Yes, this one is the Kalinsky Crystal Handle number 12. Can you guys believe I fell asleep? I was like, Wow. I'm over here bitching that I want to go see the movie and I fell asleep. You are my favorite nail tech. I don't wear nails, but I would rock everything you do. Aw, thanks, girl. Right? Doesn't it make it look a little more fancy? Like, ooh, girl, you expensive. You fancy, huh? I don't go to the movies no more. I haven't been in forever, maybe some years. Girl, I don't really like going to the movies either, but right here where I live, it's pretty, Um, what is it called? It's pretty lonely, so it doesn't get too crazy. So I'll, I go. 
But if it's too packed, then no. I'm scared I'm going to get shot the fuck up. Which is sad, you know, that I think that way. Doesn't that look gorgeous? Wow, 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 Ooh, yes, girl. I don't know what I'm about to do to these other fingers because this looks so cute. Okay. I feel like I need to put like some purple. All right, I think I'm gonna do like an ombre here. I just do movies online. Girl, I'm not sure if I'm old or I'm just, how to call it? Um, ooh, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do that little diagonal shit. Hold on. Um, I be falling asleep all the time when I watch TV. It's like either I'm not interested or I'm tired. Or both. So normally it starts up there. I'm using some full well nail tips right now. I just stabbed them into the hand. I wonder if I have my blade. Hold on, guys. Let me check if I have my blade here. Yeah, I do. Oh, man, this is my brush. Never mind. Oh, yeah, I do have it. Come on, Zule. Hurry up because this powder dries super fast. If I didn't have to drop off orders, I swear I would not go outside. Girl. They don't offer you pickup? Right? Ever since, like, COVID and shit, it's like, I don't like to go outside either. Like, my car, my car be hella fucking dirty now because I don't wash it. I used to be really good at that. Like, I love my car. But now that shit be hella neglected. Um, shipping goes by weight. So depending on how heavy, um, your package is or how big it is, then it goes up. So normally if it's below a pound, it'd be around five cookies, five to six cookies. And anything heavier than that ranges real quick between 12 to 15 cookies for a normal smaller box. All right, so I'm going to do some glitter. Some flitter. I may have picked the wrong shipping. What do you mean, my friend? Hi, I love my bling scoops. Yes, girl. I'm so excited for the next scoops because, how to call it, they're gonna be better, the bling. is like, if you love that bling scoop, girl. These are going to be better. I'm making like a little ombre with glitter. Just to incorporate all the colors, kind of. So gorgeous. And then I'm going to add gold. Yes. I remember when this was a trend. 
like the little side slit type of thing. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Zule, have you ever thought of battling people on TikTok? No. What does that mean? I mean, I know what battling means, but like, what do people, what are you going to do or what? How do you battle them or what do you do? Hold on, guys. I need more foil. I ran out. I ran out. So I guess we're going for like girly vibes, pinkish. The ring finger will be like the bling one. The um, you battle with other people and they send you gifts to win. Okay, we're gonna have to do that. But like, how do you battle? Like, you cuss each other out or what? I nah, just kidding. Whoever gets more likes and gifts in a three to four minute time, good way to make money to manita de donde es. Mm. I'm gonna have to check it out. Be like, shit, I win with the likes. My hoes can have my back. Huh. Mi mano la puedes encontrar en glamourless.com. Literally tapping screen. Mm -hmm. Gifts outweigh likes. Oh, man. Damn. I was like, shit, my hoes will, will tap away. Tap away. The other day, I was on somebody's live, another girl's live. And I think I was the only one tapping. I was like, hello, anybody else? tapping here or something because i feel like we ain't move, making no progress i was like damn i'm so grateful for y'all that be tapping away from me so i know you guys are alive and shit you know because there was no live action over there I was like so sad. Your poor finger, uh huh. I was like, oh, maybe that's why my hand hurts. I was tapping away from her. Wow, that looks so beautiful. Gorgeous. Hello. How long have I been live? I Should I even do a thumb? Does anybody even see thumbs? No, huh? I shouldn't do a thumbnail here. Hold on. Let me close some of these colors before I start dropping them by accident. I had to go watch my scoop be done. Then I came back. Tap, tap, tap is what we do. Mm-hmm. I feel like taking my nails off already so I could do them again. I just love doing my nails. Hey, Stephanie, girlfriend. How are you? All right, Lori. We'll see you later, my friend. Oh, damn. I... Ooh, thank you for the basketball. Thank you for, I'm not sure what the other one was. Are you going to put this video on your YouTube? I always try my best to save all my videos, but unfortunately not all of them save. Not all my videos save. Like I'm struggling. I'm struggling to, how to call it, save these this video. My TikTok doesn't let me save it. And it's not even like really long. So I'm like, what the hell is going on? You're taking off your nails? I want to take off my nails again so I could um do them again. 
So I'm just gonna close this up. I'm gonna do the ring finger also nude. Cause that one's gonna be the one with the bling. I guess we won't do a thumb. Nobody ever sees a fucking thumb. She fancy, huh? So I bought myself a cricket. Y ya me creo. I was like, ooh, I'm going to start labeling everything. Everything on my way is going to be labeled, shiny labels. My whole pantry is going to be labeled. I don't even know how you save two hour long videos on your phone. Girl, the longest video on my phone is like four hours is like girl who has that much storage huh like only Zule does you know how hard it is for me to erase my stuff i even try to save my video on my computer to see if the quality would remain the same and when i download it to the computer it remains good like it is is good but once I try to edit it, then it, it gets ugly. Like, what the fuck? Like, it got hella pixelated. Does anybody know why? Or what format do I need to save it on? Portia? You're the professional in here in YouTube videos, I think. Are you saving them to your Android? No, I saved it to my computer. I saved it to my computer and then I was trying to edit it to put my intro and my outro. And then when I was saving it again is when it got blurry. Like hella pixelated. Wait, say it again. The voice of when you did the nail art was really good. It wasn't blurry. Really? Or maybe my internet sucks and I see them all blurry. Love the crystals. Thank you. It's a beautiful shade. Yeah, this color is really nice. And then the more that you add, the it's more buildable. Kind of like... Like, what is it called? Like foundation. Have you always been creative? It's obvious. Um, that what that you have creative visions, they always come out great. Thank you. I feel like I am pretty creative, not just with nails. Because when I was younger, I would decorate my folder with pictures and stickers and all kinds of shit. I even um decorated one of my laptops. I got a skin for it. I'm not sure I have I upload mine from my Android because that's where it is. Oh, hmm. I wonder. Oh, shit. And only my videos that I do live get blurry. Not the ones that are like straight on my computer. I guess I'll keep looking to see what the hell I could do better. Um, But yeah, when I was in high school, I used to decorate my, my stuff. And I had a laptop in college. And I bought a skin for it with pictures. I made like a collage of myself, my child, and my hubby, boyfriend at the time. And then I bedazzled it. It's so pretty. I wish I could find that stupid thing. Zule, what color are you using? I am using Luscious Pink. This is part of my new cover collection. No, this is not Pink Salmon. Pink Salmon I use on my nails. It has more of a pinkish, peachy, orangey undertone, the cover salmon. This one is more pinkish, baby pastel vibe. There's freaking glitter on my brush. Is 
no this hand is not real it is fake so i'm just gonna add a little bit more over here i should just say it's a real hand huh yeah it's a real hand does your monomer smell strong I personally don't really smell monomers that well no more. Um, so I'm not the best one to answer that. But anybody who's tried my monomer, do you guys think it's strong? Uh, my mom, she put it back up, actually. She didn't break it. it the curtain just fell. Like the pole stayed up there, but just the curtain fell off. Let me put a little bit more here. I thought it was a real till you said. Mm -hmm. Where can I get the hand from? This hand is from glamourliz.com. Glamour is G L A M E R Liz.com. I don't think it has a strong odor at all. It has a small, it has a smell to it, but not bad. Oh yeah, so our monomer has a fragrance on it. So it doesn't smell like your typical monomer. It has like perfume. I love how monomer smells, so it does not bother me at all. All right, so my nail's looking a little nice thickness. I'm just gonna add some more here to give it that little bump, the little bump. The belly, AKA the little apex, even though my friend here, she don't even fucking do shit. Um, the rose quartz, yeah, they do look similar. The rose quartz is just a little lighter. They're similar, just one's lighter than the other one. They're sisters. Rose Quartz and Luscious Pink are sisters. I was like, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get colors that look like a shade away from each other, you know, cause sometimes we need that. Ooh, honey. Sometimes we need a little, um, a lighter shade. So I was like, okay, girl. Young nails, monomer smells like money. <laughs> You're funny. Um, yes, I do take clients. I don't work full time anymore. Well, I work full time, just not doing nails. I moved far as shit from where I work at, so I don't go all the time. I only go there twice a week. And I have not looked anywhere out here where I live, because to be honest, I, do, I don't think I want to do nails full time anymore. I can't hang. Um, this hand is actually pretty good at, like, stain, like, the nail stain. So, I just shove it in there, and that's it. This is a full well nail. How many clients do I take per day? Um, I only see three or four clients. I'm a slow-ass bitch, so... That's as busy as I'm going to get in a day because by the time I get to work, I'm already tired. I feel like my drive, my drive to work is more exhausting than my work day. Will you be doing scoops tomorrow? No, I'm not going to do scoops until next month. Um, what's the difference between dip and ombre monomer and the other one you have on your website? 
So the smooth set monomer, it it allows your acrylic to dry at a smoother pace. So like if we're working with runny acrylic, it will slow down the acrylic. Like it's not going to dry fast, but it's not going to run. And it will give you the time you need to work with it. Versus the other one, it's more for how to call it um dip powders so if you guys use dip powders those dry a lot slower it just dries them a little bit faster that's the difference hi delay hi i feel like now that i don't work um Full time doing nails. I'm all extra slow. I love how nails look unencapsulated sometimes. Me too. It's like you you can see the the texture, huh? Like that would have looked way nicer if it was just not encapsulated. Like the little gold looks so beautiful. Can you show your nails? Yes. Let me just finish this now and I'll show you guys my nails. I just have to work a little fast here with this acrylic because it dries pretty fast. That's why I can't do no one bead method with it because it's fast drying. And the heat is, is pretty intense here. Hold on. Which ones do you guys like better? The yellow ones or the Cheetah Licious? Cheetah Licious. Do you like the one bead method? Um, I personally don't only because I suck at it. <laughs> so everything I'm not good at, you know, I'm always gonna dislike. But I mean, here and there it comes through. I'm not the best at it, so I don't do it often, but here and there, I'll, I'll do it on my clients just to encapsulate faster. What am I doing wrong? Um, Sylvia, I may have missed your previous comment. Can you comment it again? Both are gorgeous. Okay, girl, let me hold your finger a little bit better so I could see better. Because we're about, we doing some lumpy shit right now. Like, Zule, what's going on with your eyeballs? I'm using my clear acrylic. Um, Hi, question, is your glue good for charms like big candy charms or jewels? Yes, ma'am, it holds everything. Especially the candies. Girl, you're going to have to file the whole motherfucking candy when you're done with that set. My beads show when I'm filing. Oh, um, like a little line? If, if you mean like you're, like it's not well blended, it's because your acrylic dried before you put your next bead. So... Try to thin it down. Like, for example, right now that I place this bead, if this was a color versus clear, and I left it too thick here, it would show where I put the next bead. So try to thin this part down. Like, when you place a bead, make it thin. How do you get your brush to stay flat like that? It's pinched. It's a pinched brush. So you just have to pinch it and train it. The more that you use it, the flatter it gets. Zule's glue is the best off on the market. Mm hmm Yes, honey. If you haven't tried it, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for, honey? What brush are you using? I am using my Kalinsky number 24. 
number 25. Porque ese calorcito. It's a little hot, so we gotta we gotta use a big brush so that it doesn't dry up too fast. Is it good to start off with a little brush or a big one? Um, I personally think you should start off with a small brush. Depending on the brand, I would say a number 8 to number 12 should be a beginner brush. Nothing above that. I mean, unless... Excuse me. Unless, how to call it, um, you want to start off with a big brush. But I feel like... Larger brushes are hard to control, so you'd want to um, learn how to control your acrylic first before you want to get a big one. You turn off the AC again? Yes, ma'am. Because we be having it on all day, we want to give it a, a little rest. I don't remember life without the labeling adhesive. Girl, I don't know what I would fucking do if that glue would not be a thing. I think I would just have to stop doing nails. Like, I'm going to have to stop adding bling to people because, girl, that was my one fear of my clients getting bling and messaging me like, Delay, my bling fell off. Like, what the fuck? How? If you could use your clinic for a dip, what kind of liquid do you use for it? My acrylic? For dip? When you use dip, you don't use monomer. Like, if you're going to dip it, you don't use monomer. You use something else. I've never done it, so I don't know. But dip powders are just acrylic. Dip powders are acrylic, just extra fine. Extra, extra fine. These nails are beautiful. They're going to look extra beautiful once we top coat them. So how's the live? Uh, is it lagging still or not no more? They give me like little princess vibe. No, no more. Maybe there was too many people. We couldn't handle it. I never lost a single stone ever since I started using your glue. Oh, yes, honey. It's not lagging for me. It keeps pausing. Hmm, I wonder why it pauses for some people, but not everybody. Because for me, it's not lagging anymore. Good for most parts. Okay. That's good. As long as it's not like hella lagging, that's good. That's good. I want a piña colada. All right, Zile. Let's check the little side profile. Just a little bit at the tip. It's not lagging for me. Man, I wish I was so fast. I could finish a set in one hour. You know how many bitches that'd be pumping out of my chair? <laughs> like three. <Hey. laughs> I, I would have been done work in three hours. Time to go home. Will the bling adhesive work without the activator? Yes, it works without the activator, but if you if you use it um over gel polish, I recommend to use with an activator because um over over gel it takes longer to dry. And he said I take less than two hours. Girl, I don't. I be a slow ass bitch. My whole body hurts. Do you pack orders live? I haven't packed an order live in a good minute. 
I haven't packed an order live in a few weeks because it becomes a distraction for me. And how to call it? I feel like the lighting in there is not the best. Are you doing more nails after these? I'm not sure. It depends what time I finish. Yes, the activator is a life is a game changer. I mean, life ain't game changer because no mames. Ain't nobody got time to be waiting for your shit to dry. Mm -mm. I'm working on getting my own activator. So we'll have a Zule activator. Yes, girl, you could glue whatever you want over over um, top coat. I just recommend if you are going to do that to how to call it, um, buff the little area so that so that how to call it, it sticks better and it's going to move around. All right, so I'm going to file these nails. Let me just. I'm using my nail forms as a little armrest, but it keeps opening, so I'm just going to seal it. All right, so I'm going to start off with this finger. I put rhinestones, then top coat. The rhinestones last longer anywhere else. Yeah, when you apply anything to a rough surface, it will forever last extra long, no matter if you bump them versus if you put them over top coat. But sometimes, I mean, they still last a long time if you put them over top coat as well. But it's just a lot better if you can to do it before. Does your arm hurt holding the hand? Yes, my hands always hurt, whether I hold this fake hand or a real one. That's why I don't really do nails a lot anymore, because everything hurts. So take care of your body, ladies and gentlemen. If you guys do nails, don't overwork yourself because you want the money. Work smart, because long term, it's going to hurt. Trust me, I know what I'm saying. Yeah, like money's good and all that. You want to make that bag, but you need to think long term as well. So make sure that your room is ventilated, properly ventilated. Um, how to call it? You have a dust collector. You sit correctly, get a nice, a good chair. Because if you're going to be doing this long term, girl, let me tell you, start taking care of yourself now. How come when I do long taper square nails and while I file, they look like coffin after? Um, maybe you're filing too much of the side. If you know that that happens for you, try try um, doing a square tip first and then file until the end to tapered square, not coffin. Yeah, they do look cool, man, huh? Como la flor. Do you not like the drill? I do like it, but I prefer hand fighting first. I prefer hand fighting because I feel like the shape comes out better. I don't know. That's just me.
Ham filing is painful after a while, but it's worth it. To use the glove at all for your hands when it comes to the UV light, nope. I use a glove to file so that I don't ruin my nails. But right now I don't really care. Or like my hands get sweaty and shit, so I don't want my client to feel my sweaty ass hands. But this client, she cool. She sweats too. She sweaty. So right here, I'm just looking at my little nail. And my little nail. I heard the UV light can make your hands look older. Well... All the lights now are mostly LED, not really UV. So we should be fine. Can you come to Baltimore? Um, I do not travel, but if you come to California, that'd be easier. Oh, you got your scoops. Everybody got their scoops already. Ma'am, your finger go that way. Do you guys have any topics that we can talk about? Meanwhile, do the, the nail. The filing. The client is so quiet. I know she don't like to talk. <laughs> Can you zoom out a little bit? Yes, ma'am. Hopefully that's good. She's me out of time. Mm hmm. Any shaping techniques? Um, I like to file the top part of the nail first and then the rest of the body. I am tired, Barber Chica. I feel like the time of the month is coming, so everything fucking hurts. Let's talk about how people talk shit about home-based nail techs, but not chop shops. Oh, you mean like customers? Customers don't talk shit about them? Girl, fucking customers will talk shit about a small business. Like an independent small business nail tech. Not just home base, just anybody. Like, oh my god, you charge too much. Oh my god. And it's like, girl, but you walk out with these chiclets as motherfucking nails, but you're going to act picky with me, Felicia? Bye. Get the fuck out of here. Salsa verde or roja? Ooh, girl. I've been a salsa verde for a long time, but sometimes I feel salsa roja is good. I see that they get hammered for everything. I guess it depends. Chop sh the regular nail shops, they they get a little bit of both. They don't want to charge for quality. Some places do charge good, even though the quality is not that that much. It's not that good. I just made enchiladas this morning. Ooh, yes. Hi, Sanfana. How are you, girl? I had my nails that long until I fell down and broke four of them. Ooh, Elizabeth, why would you tell me? That's so, so painful. How did you and Mimi meet? Um, I met her here in LA. Well, actually, I reached out to her a few years ago um i stumbled across her youtube channel and i was like 
I'm going to send her some of my glue to see if she likes it. Because at the time, she was using nail glue, I think, to adhere her crystals. And I was like, she does amazing work. So let me send her my glue because I know she can... She's going to love it and her bling is not going to fall off. And from there, we kept in touch until she moved here in California to California. And I did her nails. She asked me to do her nails when she moved here. And actually, no, I went to meet her before that when she came to California to do some a class. And then I started doing her nails when she moved here. All right, so let me use my on-point disc to file the tip really quick because, girl, my arm hurts. So, ma'am, turn your hand around. How do you feel about clients who come to you and talk smack about their previous nail tech? Oh, hell no. I do not even... I hate when people do that. I hate it. So, I just listen, but I don't say shit back until they stop talking about them. I hate when they do that. Like, you know, if they're talking shit about them. They must have said something about you. If they've been to you before. My eyes are a little blind right now. So, se salen poquito shwicks. Yes, I hate when people say shit like that. Or they'll be like, oh my god, I hate my nails. And blah, blah, blah. Like, let me show them to you. And, and they're not even ugly. It's like, girl, they cute. What you talking about? Oh, shit. So, I always try to file my client's nails backwards like this. So that I can see what they see. Not gonna lie. I do put a crooked nail sometimes. I need that drill. I do not sell the drill, but the drill bit is on my website. It is called the on point disc bit. I use it mostly for the tip because I feel like it helps me a lot with like my arm. And then occasionally I'll use it to shape the nails. Especially when doing stiletto nails, honey. Because, girl, getting it to be pointy is a pain in your ass. And my hands hurt already. Like, I'm an old lady already. Just kidding. But my hands do hurt. So the least hand filing or any type of filing I do, the better. Alright, so let me just file this off. Oh, grrr, honey. Alright, let me get my, my handy dandy extra fine bit now. To remove any scratches. Just purchase the glue. How fast does it dry learning to do nails? It depends on the weather. Right now that it's hot, it dries a little bit fast. So, well... Whether it's hot or cold, it kind of dries fast. But if you want more time, uh, apply it over top coat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with practice, girl, you will get better. I'm saving up for my 45 acrylics. Oh yes, honey. Are you gonna get the solid ones or the or the glitter? Most important drill bits you recommend. Um well definitely you need a sanding band. You need if you only offer acrylic services, I recommend for you to have a extra fine or fine bit a coarse extra coarse one to remove decor or acrylic you know like if somebody wants you to remove their nails and then you need um some cuticle bits 
for the cuticle area. Um, I'm not really focusing on sealing the, the cuticles here because the hand is not real and I don't really want to damage her cuticles so I'm just going in there lightly. But with a client, you would kind of pass the electric file around the cuticle a few times. With this bit, it makes it so much easier for you not to cut your client because it's nice and round. So you just go in like this. And you always wanna, you always wanna hold your file flat, not like curved, like angle like this sticking up. That is so wrong. It always has to be like this. I feel like I'm estoy tragando el polvo a la verga. Oh, honey, you like the files? I'm going to be adding some, some buffers. I already have buffers, but like the full pack of buffers because I've been getting a lot of requests for for like a wholesale, I guess, or not wholesale, but like bulk. I'm at 18 RPMs right now. <laughs> La toxica ni su sit still. I know that bitch got on the table already and shit. Like, girl, relax. Ma'am, sit your ass down. I can't wait to put the bling and bling, 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 bling. I legit want them for my birthday next month. Ooh, girl, when's your birthday? Can I see a demo for the disc drill bit you have? Um, I just used it right now on the nail. You didn't see? I'll make another video. <laughs> Careful, her knuckles are red. Uh-huh. She a fighter. What if you try new new bit for sealing what if try your new b the the what is it called the on point disc no i would not recommend trying that for anything but shaping the nail yeah this one is not the guy Again. The little one, I can smell the stale socks through the phone. Hey, girl, girl, who socks? Who socks you smelling? I'm ready for winter sets, girl. I'm ready for fall. I went to Hobby Lobby and they had a bunch of fall stuff. Fall decor and I'm like, mm, honey. I purchased stickers. Do you do I have to encapsulate? Um, if they are thin stickers, you do not oh shit. You do not have to encapsulate them. You could just apply top coat. But I mean, if they if it makes you feel better, encapsulate them. I'm ready for fall too. I love fall. I'm ready for pumpkin everything.
Oh shit. Bitch, can you stay still, please? Thanks. All right, Toxica. We're almost done, girl. You just need to stay still now. Just gonna buff her real quick. I'm using my pink buffer, which is a great 100 by 100. My favorite season. Oh, I'm gonna say, yeah, I guess I like the colors for fall. I like the color tones, the pumpkin, everything in fall. But my favorite for weather is the winter. I'm a winter baby, so. I love winter. I feel like a lot of us, our, our birthday months are our favorite seasons. May baby over. Zule used a buffer and files you sent me today. So bomb. Yes, Kathleen. I'm glad you like you you like what I sent you. How did you do the flower? I encapsulated it. I'm gonna be saving or attempting to save this video on my YouTube channel. So if you guys follow me on YouTube, you guys will get to see it. I'm just going to buff them good so that you can see the encapsulated flowers real good. All right, this bitch is going to go wash her hands now. One second, please. Let me leave you guys with this one. And this one for now. So you guys don't go nowhere. Don't go nowhere, everybody. Don't go nowhere. Let me go wash my hands. Alrighty, let's see. Wow, she looks beautiful. Alright, say goodbye to my fake hands. Oh, they're getting dusty porque tengo todo el pinche dust aquí a la verga. Just I didn't even plug my phone, it's already supercharged. Let's see how long have I been on here for oh, honey, an hour 30 minutes. Oh no, but I was on life prior to that, huh? What has Patrick done during summer vacation? He has been working. Hold on, let me file this. A little piece of the I've had him working he's making his money his little money helping his mom cooking um I told him that this week we're gonna make another video for our YouTube channel so if you guys are not following us on YouTube make sure to go subscribe to our little channel it's called Zule and Patrick Eats The hat is from Glamour Liz. Glamour Liz official. I mean, why the fuck do I keep saying that? Glamourliz.com. So I think I'm going to add like one of these little thingies. 
Does Patrick get a 1099? No, he gets paid cash. He don't work that much. He will get a 1099 when he gets older. Ooh, actually I have some in here. Why does it say I'm muted? I'm not sure. Somebody probably muted you. <sighs> okay, let's see. What color bling bling? I'm gonna put a little bit of baby. I'm really thinking I'm gonna do one of these crystals. I'm just gonna put it here because I feel like I really wanna use that crystal. Like for sure, for sure. All right, I'm gonna use my bling adhesive, my crusty ass bling adhesive. How did I choose his name? So, hold on, I'm gonna clip off the crustiness on here so you guys can see how I remove it this is the 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 new plastic bottle so it's super easy to open um so in high school I had my son when I was in high school right I was in 10th grade when I had my child so in ninth grade there was this guy I didn't like him or anything like that because I feel like a lot of people think that when I say that I got it from this dude there was this football player in school. So normally I just clip it off, but I can't fucking clip it. Um, there was this guy in high school whose name was Patrick. And back in the day, I mean there's still not a lot of Patrick's. I I really like that name and I was like, hmm, I'll probably name him Patrick. And then I also liked another name. But he ended up, he was born on St. Patrick's Day. So it was just easier to name him that. Oh, shit. <laughs> she literally says the same thing. Uh-huh. The girl with the stale socks. I can't fucking open this stupid thing good. Well, anyway, that's the way I clip it off normally. But I'm going to spend all day doing that. We need to get to this bling bling. So this is the glue. Alrighty, let's bedazzle dazzle. Um, I'm gonna add a little bit here. I'ma add this yellow looking one because I don't have gold. And this one looks kind of nice. Um, yes, these are the Zule crystals. This one that I'm using right now is called Juanquil AB. And I believe this is 5mm. And then these are also Juanquil AB. The, the pointy and the flat backs. Hold on, let me get some gold balls. I'm going to be using some gold balls. Oh, this one's open. Young people snack. I'm giving her a chance. Oh shit, oh shit. Damn, I have too much going on in this table. I feel like I need a table that's in shape of an L. So I could just move my shit to the side. Like Zulay. Hold on. Portia on, on here. So if y'all say anything stupid, she gonna block you. And then we ain't unblocking your ass. Okay, let's get it started. Also, San Juana, she here. They ain't messing around. Okay, 
I always put the crystal twigs. So I'm just going to put a little bit of gold in there. Hold on, let me flip the fucking hand. Girl, that shit is hella sideways. Let me fix you real quick before you complain. Hold on, man. Damn, even my balls, my balls came off. Mm -hmm. Anybody ever say their fucking bling fell off, honey? You didn't add enough glue. Are you sure you even had a crystal on there? Are you sure? Hold on. Ma'am, Zule, I just took off my nails Saturday. I had them since I got my package from you. Ooh, yes, I knew. I'm already having, I'm already getting annoyed here. Hold on. Let me wait for that to dry so I can file the little piece of the crystal that stayed behind. Meanwhile, let's focus on the ring finger. I'm going to do a big one. So if you guys struggle with bling bling stain on your nail, you need some Zule, Zule bling adhesive, okay? And you need to make sure that you add enough enough glue because not just one little drop ain't gonna save you especially if your crystals are big they will not stay in un putazo i have to flip her hand around so i can see better okay she wished someone would troll her for fun. <laughs> I know sometimes it's a low key. I do wish that. So right here, I'm just going to add a few little crystals. Nothing too crazy. And then I'm going to have a full bling nail watch. I'm using the Honkwil AB ones right now. Let me zoom in. The Zulay crystals. And Honkwil and some Crystal AB. So all of these are part of the Zule crystals. These are in Crystal AB. I just put them in a box. When are you restocking the squeeze bottle? I thought I restocked it earlier. I didn't restock it. Double check. I could have sworn I restocked it earlier today. Oh, shit. My glue fell. My glue. It fell. So, I really want to use one of these little thingies. I might put it here. Uh, you checked yesterday? Yeah, I... I was um, checking my store today and I saw it was sold out, but we still have some. So I, I fixed that. Maybe I should make it a little lower. Right there. So I could put a little crystal. Zule, am I tripping? What? What's on your thumb? I missed it. <laughs> oh, they're little stickers. It's because I I have um a cricket now. Oh, cr cric cr cr whatever it's called. And I was um I was what do you call it? Cutting letters out earlier, and I didn't want to throw them away because they're so pretty. So I just put them on my nail. Yeah, and I was like, they'll fall off by themselves. Um, it, These crystals, you can buy them on my website. The link is on my bio. They are under the Zule crystals. The one you just put on. Oh, 
the little gold things. The little arrow looking thingy majingy. Um, I'm going to be adding them to my store as well. I forgot to add them, but they're coming to my store. Some of these little gold figures, actually, I was putting them in the, in the, what is it called? In the scoops. Because you can never have enough nail art. Oh, que la verga. Fucking bitch, stop fucking falling. You fucking hoe bag. Maybe, maybe it's too heavy. So it's a little love and hate with these balls because they do not want to stick sometimes to the stick. I'm going to be doing the scoops again next month. I don't know yet what day. If it's going to be in the beginning, the end, or whatever. But I will definitely keep you guys posted. Because I need to prepare in advance this time. That way I don't have to be restocking and restocking. I'm making like a low-key little weenie here. Little penis. Weenie. Is that glue? Yes. This is the glue that I'm using. Oh, shit. The Zulabling adhesive. It's available for 10 cookies on my website. Best 10 cookies that you will invest in your business. Wait, who's a hoe bag? <laughs> um, I forgot. What did I say? Did I say somebody was a hoe bag? I don't remember saying that. But I don't remember a lot of things, so... If I'm going to drop a Halloween collection, um, probably not because I dropped one last year and I fell in love with those. So I'm going to, I'm not sure if I still have them on the website or not, but if I don't, I'm going to bring them back. But who knows? Maybe I'll have a solid color collection this time. I don't know. I feel like I always do the same fucking design sometimes. Did I say that? Did I say something whole bag? I don't remember saying that. I think I was calling the stupid ball that maybe. Because it keeps fucking falling. A Halloween mystery. Yes, you did. <laughs> did you teach yourself rhinestone placement? Um, Yes, I pretty much learned little by little. And then also by watching other nails. The more that you look, I'm just waiting for it to dry. Oh, yeah, I was probably talking to the ball because it kept falling. Si, a las bolitas le dijiste así. Oh, si. Yeah, I always cuss out my balls here because they, they're they like a love and hate. And it's like, fucking little, fucking little bitch. Um. So for my next scoops, I'm going to be adding gel to the mix. Like a scoop by itself for gel. And we'll do like some fall color gels. To prep you guys for the fall. What's included in the scoops? So pretty much the scoops are a scoop. I use like a, a pan. Last time I was using a little pan. And I mix a few different nail art or acrylics in a bin. And then I use that pan to scoop out product. And so pretty much you pre-order for the scoop party. Like let's just say you buy one, two scoops. 
Then I use that, that pan to scoop two times. And whatever the pan grabs, kind of like the claw, then that's for you. Then we ship that out to you. These balls hid underneath the bling. Come on, you balls, get out of there. So pretty much that's what the scoops are. Oh, man. Oh, well, the balls went in there. <laughs> the balls went in deep. Mm, how long does it take for the glue to dry? It can take seconds. It's pretty fast. It could take seconds. Um, if you need more time, then I recommend for you to apply it over top coat because top coat over top coat it dries slower. I'm a, I'm so upset I missed the scoops. Don't worry, honey. We will do it again. We will do it again. I'm a survivor. La mamá de 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 Zuzu. Zuzu had a little lamb. Little lamb, little lamb. No, that's not real. She a fake. She a fake bitch. She's coming up pretty cute. That's so pretty. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and add more gold to the mix. Only because I love gold. We're gonna add some little balls here. Like a little outline. Raise your hand if you like gold. Raise your hand if you like balls. Do you do, you do acrylic scoops? Yes. I had acrylic scoops. I had bling scoops. Oh my god, these fucking balls are annoying me. It's like Zule. If you already know how these balls are, why you keep fucking putting them? Because they're so beautiful. Mm -hmm. That way nobody can tell if you're if you're raising your hand for the balls or for the gold. Or both. Little by little. This is why a bitch takes so long. Cause she she picks the hardest things to do. Like blood. Do you guys remember if I did the cap the flowers first before I started my second life? Who's been here since I started? Who can tell me if I did the flowers before my before I I um Did I do the flowers in this life or the other one? You hadn't started on until the second life. Oh, okay. I was just putting in the tips then, huh? Oh, ooh, honey. I have forgot already. How much is the rhinestone on your site? I want to leave the live. <laughs> um, the crystals, they vary from, from shape and size. But they're all pretty affordable. Don't worry. If you leave the live, we'll still be here. Uh, 
I'm just kidding. We might not be here. Don't go anywhere. These are beautiful. They look so cute. Portia. So anyway, you just reminded me. When did you already record your your nail art? Remember, you were going to be twins with my fake hand. The one with the eye. Girl, all your bling is bomb. Even the non Swarovski. Mm -hmm. So I'm not using any Swarovski. And check it out. I got a little wax pen on there. But I'll buff them out right now. I try to have a little... A little... um, What do you call it? Variety for everyone. For all budgets. Let me just remove the little silver backing. There you go. Okay, I'm just going to do a so Not yet. I've been so busy. I'm like, Zule is going to be like, did you do it? Girl, I forgot. I just remembered right now. But don't worry. It's good to be busy. So I forgive you. We forgive you. Do your thing, girl. It'll get done when it gets done. I just remembered right now because... um, I forgot why I remembered, to be honest. But it just came to my head. With your bling glue, can we lay it on top of top coat? Yes, you can. Um, if you guys use my bling adhesive over top coat, um, I recommend, especially if you're doing big crystals, just scratch the nail just a little bit so that they don't run around the nail. Because I find it that when I apply it over top coat, they move so much and they get on my fucking nerves. But that's just me. Maybe I'm just impatient. I don't know. So I scratch it a little. Like, let's just say if I knew I was going down the middle, like here, I'd scratch just a line. But if you're doing something like this, then I'd use the hand file or nothing at all. Just spray activator quickly. Um. Also, I have like thousands of videos to upload first, including your glitters and the package you sent me. Ooh, girl, you have a lot of content. Can I have some of your content so I can put on my channel? I'm suffering here with no content. I have no content. I think that's why I have no likes on my my Instagram because I have no content. I have to reuse my shit because Zule does not do nails anymore. That's the bad thing about having your own fucking little side business. Anything is like you don't got you don't got time to fucking make content. It's like, girl, I'm not trying to be sitting in no motherfucking office. I'm trying to be here, hanging out with my hoes. She. Low-key, that looks like a fucking uterus. How does she make the design with acrylic? Um, I'm going to be posting it on Instagram. I mean, the fuck? In the YouTube. Yeah, Instagram doing a lot of dirty. A lot of dirty, dirty. You should go live next time you do Mimi's nails. I know my husband told me the same thing. He's like, you should go live when you do her nails. But then I'm like, but then I can't talk to my hoes because I'm going to be doing her nails. But for sure, I'm going to record them. I make my content back to back then take break. But for my subscribers, it's like I never live. <laughs> That's true. I think I'm going to start making myself a schedule. Like Monday through whatever I'm going to record. And then the other days I will. I'll post them up. So this nail I'm going to do kind of like 
the one on my finger. The set is fire, girl. Yes, honey. Thank you very much. I'm trying to bring you guys some variety. Um, yes, I'm going to try to post this video sometime this week. I'm actually trying to get up my yellow nails first. Yes, this is a practice hand. I'm going to try to do like a little crown. A little crown wannabe. Sometimes I feel like I cover my designs and it's like, Zule, girl, why you do that for? Honey, why you do that for? Gems go on with top coat, not glue. Help a girl. No, girl, this is glue. It's not top coat. It is a Zule bling adhesive. Mimi always hangs up on us on YouTube Live when she's getting her nails done. Yeah, it's because she'd be multitasking. And then her phone be dying, so she needs to charge it and stuff. You're like, girl, girl, we need to finish the live. In love with the bling, the bling, 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 bling. Oh, honey, that's too big. I'm supposedly trying to make a crown here, but there's no way in hell this is going to look like a crown. I freaking love these. Yes, honey. What's your favorite color, Portia? Will you post these finish on TikTok or Instagram? I'm going to post a picture on both. I'm just going to leave it like that before I cover my flower. Because, you know, flower power. Okay, let me spray the activator. Where do I have it? So right now we're out of stock of activator, I think. I tried to buy more this weekend. But the company does not have any. And they're fucking sold the fuck out. And I'm like, honey, my hoes need activators. All right, hold on. Let me close the fucking box. Oh, shit. So this box, I, I saved it from back in the day when I had more boxes of, of these, but it's broken. I keep all the broken stuff. I'm not going to put anything on the pinky because it has glitter. And I feel like how to call it. If I put anything, I'm going to ruin it. Where do you buy these stones? They are available for purchase on my store. They are part of the Zule crystals. So if you go into the rhinestone category, there is an option for Zule crystals and they are on there. I have some that are flat back, round ones, and then the shapes. Oh my God, I just noticed I didn't put any on this one. It doesn't need it. Does it need a Zule? Does it? I'm like, does it need it? Does it? All right, let's see. Let's top coat. This hand is is from Glamour Liz. So I'm gonna type it in with this phone so you guys can see it. Um, let me see. Maybe I can tag her. Glamour Liz. That's her her TikTok. Oh shit. So I, I put her TikTok in there. 
So let's see. Let's put top coat. And I'm using my Zule top coat. I'm going to put top coat on the gold, the little gold piece to kind of preserve it. I mean, not that this bitch is going to wash her hands and shit, right? She did once, but that's it. And I'm going to put some on the balls. Ooh, this is so pretty. Let me zoom it in as I put the top coat. If you guys have not tried this top coat, y'all need it in your fucking life. It is lip gloss, honey. Lip gloss. Ooh, honey, I came back and this set is done. Mm-hmm. We were not playing today. Ooh, girl. Ryan is giving like princess. It's funny because they were supposed to be pink and purple and they ended up more like flower and gold. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it, thug life. I want to make another sunflower set. Yeah, this is the top coat. So, ooh. Fuck, I got fucking. You have inspired me. I'm doing my nails first thing tomorrow. Yes, girlfriend. Yes, a fall sunflower set. I did myself a sunflower set early. I don't even know when the fuck it was. Not too long ago. Bomb. Everybody was saying that it was kind of like fall vibes. So, I want to do a. a Sunflower set, more summer vibes. All right, and then the pinky. And then the pinky. Ooh, yes. Honey, very beautiful. Wow. I love the finish look like, ooh. La la, honey, you're so cute. I think I'm gonna do a unicorn set next. What length are your neon nails? Um, I use the three XL square tips for my nails. So let me just dry her really fast. Let me dry this bitch. Sorry. I don't think it's plugged in. Oh, shit. Excuse me. Are we not plugged in something? Hmm. Hold on, guys. Why is my shit not on? Oh, silly rabbit tricks are for kids. Hold on, guys, my shit unplugged. There you go. There you go. All right, ma'am, stick your hand in the lamp. Don't move. Hi, that hand looks so real. She needs some lotion. <laughs> For real. I low-key kind of filed her skin a little bit. So she looks a little a little extra dry. Did any stones fall off the nail lamp? You bedazzle? Nope. They're hella stuck. 
I did my own nails for the third time ever. Was nervous to post a video of them. I did. Yes, honey. You gotta post your work. If not, how are people gonna see it? Don't be embarrassed to post your stuff. It's the only way people are gonna see your work. <sighs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Me so sleepy. I feel like I want to do another ocean set. I feel like I didn't get enough of ocean. I love mermaid nails. I love ocean. Ocean vibes. Every summer I feel like I have to have one of those. But this time I'll probably do it blue. My mat is cute. Thank you very much. It is super full of acrylic and glitter. Ooh, honey. Love how real you are. I try. I try. Ooh. Let me cool, sh cool her down before she wants to touch them. How long does it typically, typically, uh, typically take you to do log set? I've tried to get faster. I take two to three hours. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me zoom out. She's cooling down. Like, ma'am, don't touch shit. Do not touch shit. All right. She dry now. She dry. So check her out. Oh, wait. Let me clean her bling. Yeah, speed is just not for all of us. Some people are super fast. Some people can never be fast. Like, I feel like I could never be fast. I'm just slow, period. But there's people who are fast, fast. Like, one hour, and I'm like, girl, I could never. See, Mimi makes me want to go fast. I know. Ooh, sorry. I know me too. I'm like, oh, yeah, I could do it. I could do it. But I just can't. I feel like, nope. I just cannot. I feel like I just take my sweet ass time, period. So this is the final look. What do you guys think? Let's bend her. Um, I'm just cleaning, I just cleaned it with a regular napkin. It doesn't have anything on it. Just to remove any fingerprints. Or oils, wax stick, whatever is on there. And you guys can see here that I use the same color on both of these nails, but the application was thicker on the ring finger, so it looks more pinkish. So if you want to make it look like you have a different color, you can um, swatch one of your sticks with a light like a thin coat and then another one a thicker coat and then you got yourself two shades of nude so there you go ladies and gentlemen that's la toxica for you today she did a pretty good job sitting still I can't wait to start doing like emerald colors and all of that. Mm, Toxica's nails on fire. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go find some jewelry for this bitch so I could take a picture. But I hope you guys like the video. Yes, me too. I'll try to be back again tomorrow maybe or on Wednesday. And... um. Let's see when I put up my, my yellow nails. I'll try to work on that right now too. Getting that shit downloaded and up on YouTube. So make sure to go 
um subscribe to my youtube channel zulace nails also my youtube channel with my son zulace i mean zulay and patrick eats if you guys want to learn how to cook or you just want to hang out with us we have a little family going on over there oh my god i'm so sleepy already all right guys thank you guys for joining me i'll see you guys next time good night everyone say goodbye to la toxica toxica do, 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 toxica we're gonna have to give her a song all right good night everyone goodbye see you next time thank you for hanging out and thank you to my moderators for keeping control on these comments <laughs> i'm sorry guys all right bye all right